Hey, nice to see you again on the Crocfix channel. Let's see today what are the upgrade options on the HP Victus laptop 16RO series. So if you want to buy the RAM or SSD, you can buy them directly from my video description link. We have here an HP Victus and uh, I will show you how to open it and what are the upgrade options here on this laptop. So the correct model of this one is, just a second, we have a box here. So it's 16 minus R0456NG. And I can show you this here on the box. Wait, where you can see this. So, there you should be able to see it. All right. So let's go and open it up and see what is inside. So we have here one, two, three, four screws on the top and one, two, three, four screws on the bottom. There are no, uh, these are normal Phillips screws. Okay, let's go and try to open up this thing now. We will go from the back here or from the front. We need to make a gap here between the this back cover which we just unscrewed and the middle frame from the keyboard. So You need to make a small gap here, like this. So you can come in with a plastic tool here. For example, pry tool for opening up phones and screens. And then you slowly go and try to separate this back cover here. All right, excuse me. You just slowly open this up. Uh, you don't want to break this small little uh, tooth here because later it would be difficult to reassemble it. So let's put this down and then we try to go and proceed here. Sometimes you need to turn around like this and then we go again. There we go. So we just managed to 
remove this back cover. All right. So now, as you see, we have here two coolers. There is the GPU and the CPU here. This is the slot for the SSD. And we have two slots for the RAM memory, which can be also increased. So if you want to replace the battery, the battery number is WK04XL. I can zoom in this for you. All right, so that's the battery. And uh, yeah, I will also replace the SSD here just now. So let's see how it's done. Firstly, you must disconnect the battery here before you do any changes on the laptop. You don't want to do any short circuit here. And then let's go and zoom in here a little bit. You will see on the right side here, you need to remove two screws. Just take a corresponding screwdriver. It's a Phillips screwdriver. So firstly, let's remove this black screw here on the right side. And then this small black screw here on the left side and you just lift up this one all right so then you can just go and lift up here this together uh, you have to know that um, this is made from two pieces and uh, actually you could uh, try to remove, let's see if you can remove this one just straight here from the... Alright, now so as you see the mm, SSD is coming here out, you need to be carefully when you take it out because don't uh, break here the connectors or something all right so let's go take our new ssd and we will just go and replace the ssd here let me double check So this is going well. There is double-sided adhesive here, which is a little bit sticky. So this we can remove. And then let's go and insert the new SSD. Actually, this is going to be like this way, so it's going to under the under this one and then we just put it here in like this all right perfect and then we will go and stick this on the top here all right so you insert the SSD here in this and then you just go and we go and press this on the top here like this. Perfect. Then you take the two screws and put them back here. And also this one. So double check if everything is sitting right. Okay, perfect. So let's just connect the battery back.
There we go. Perfect. So as you can see, uh, there is only one M2 uh, uh, slot for an SSD. So you can't actually connect any further um, uh, SSD or hard drive. So there are two slots for the RAM, one for the SSD. There is the battery and this is it. What you can replace or what you can uh, extend. Extend the space, the hard drive or you can upgrade the memory. So now we will go and put back here this middle frame or the back frame here. Just put it back, then press it down everywhere around that you hear the clicking sound. Perfect. Also double check here on the sides if it's sitting perfectly, it is. And then we just take these two screws, put them back here, in place. Let me know in the comments uh, if the video was helpful for you or if you have any questions about the laptop or anything else if you just want to say thank you. Thanks for watching. If the video did somehow help you, then you can buy me a coffee. Donations are always appreciated. Thank you. You find a donation link in my about page and in the video description. Please also like, comment and share the video. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.